Earth. Welcome back guys to another edition of Looted. Today we are looking at yet again another item which I bought from Wish, which I think is going to be a tad dangerous. I should really stop buying this kind of thing because one day I'm going to lose an eye and it's going to be all caught on camera and I'm going to look stupid. But for the time being I am trying my luck once again and I am checking out what's in this tiny little plastic envelope. Inside here we've got toothpicks and the components of a mini crossbow. Now, despite this thing only firing toothpicks, I am quite worried about how badly this could go. For one, I have no idea how powerful this little guy actually is. It might be able to fire toothpicks through paper. It might be able to fire it through metal. I have no idea. It could be surprisingly powerful and surprisingly dangerous, but hey, that's the fun of a Wish product. You never know how it works until you use it. Of course, you could check out other videos that people have done on these crossbows, but where's the fun in that? So inside the bag, we've got the stock of the crossbow just here. It's got a cute little trigger down here, and I actually like the little details they've put onto this thing. It's got an arrow on either side embossed, and it's got tiny grips just there. So actually, that's not a bad little build right there. Then we've got a couple of limbs for the crossbow here. So these will sit on it horizontally somehow. I'm really not too sure, but we'll figure it out eventually. The string of the crossbow, which is made out of a metal cable. Seems a bit overkill for toothpicks, but as long as it works, doesn't matter. Bit of metal, which I have no idea what it is, and a single screw. Now the fact that this mini crossbow came with no instructions and I have pretty much zero experience with crossbows, be it mini or normal sized, I might mess up putting this thing together, but hopefully with only about three parts, not much can go wrong, which would be my famous last words when I get a toothpick to the face. Cocks in like that, and then... That's a good sign. That is a cute little crossbow right there. Now let's see how well it fires a toothpick. Now to lock and load, I think we just slot that down there. Don't think you need to do much else. Let's try it out. Three, two, one. <clears throat> well, it was cute, definitely not deadly. <laughs> Let's just quickly try it on this lens cap. Will it knock it over? Yes! For my next trick shot, I'm going to try and get it in Zangief's tiny butthole. That's the weirdest sentence I've said all week. Fire! <laughs> Where did that go? It bounced off his marvellous behind. I feel like that was the closest one yet. I think I've got to get a little lower. Yes! Popsicle Zangief. Admittedly, when I bought him, he was a keychain, which is why he has a hole in his butt. So I shouldn't feel too bad. But you know, you can't help but feel bad for the poor son when he's got the face like that. And extract on your way, lad. Now this can go one of two ways. It's either gonna go through the card or bounce right back into my face. That's why I wear glasses, people. That really made me flinch. It didn't penetrate it, but it's definitely stuck in the card. I was pretty much 100% confident that was gonna go right back into my face. Video trick shot. Ow! Yeah. Imagine going to get your first ever piercing and the guy behind the counter goes, well, we're out of needles, but we've got this mini crossbow. Don't worry, the splinters aren't that bad. Take this, utility bill. <gasps> I thought of another bad wrestling name. Utility bill. Utility bill! <laughs> <laughs> General waste energy, Max Headroom, major damage, broken, utility bill, <laughs> and landfill. All right, this is turning out to be a not very exciting video, so let's up the ante. I don't know what's better, the back of the hand, front of the hand, arm, arm? Okay, we'll go for forearm. I know this doesn't stick in the paper, I know this doesn't stick in the card, but I'm still kind of scared. Kids, up here. Don't try this at home. There we go, now all liability is taken off my shoulders. Time to shoot my arm. Uh, yeah. Ooh. Right now I've got to shoot you. For my final attempt at a trick, I'm gonna try and shoot out a candle with a crossbow, which fires projectiles made out of wood. This could go terribly wrong. Three, two, one. Did he hit me in the eye, that one? Thing is, I've got to act fast, because if the wick burns too quickly, I'm not gonna be able to hit it, because it'd be too small. Move. That's a start, isn't it? <gasps> it actually happens. 
I'm gonna be honest, after my 50th attempt, I didn't think that was ever gonna happen. But there you go. I don't think we're gonna do are we gonna do any better than that? No. Are you sure? We've been here for an hour. Not just doing that. Well, the viewers don't know that. Well, after managing to shoddily pull off two tricks and scatter about 60 toothpicks around the studio, I think I can honestly say that this mini crossbow is not that great. But for £6 or $8 and coming from Wish, it pretty much ticks all the boxes for a product which isn't going to meet your full expectations. Saying that, I still very much enjoy the build. The fact that it's all made out of metal, there's literally zero plastic on this thing, which is pretty impressive. And it fires wood. It's the most economical thing I've ever bought from Wish now I think about it. The little details on the crossbow, the drawstrings nice and locks into place. It is a cute little crossbow and it does what it says on the tin, just not as well as you might have hoped. But if you're looking for a new way to dish out toothpicks in a stylish manner, this will be your guy. Hey Charles, could you pass me a toothpick? Oh, sure thing, Troy. Oh my eye. Shout out to Natasha Savage on Patreon. And if you like this video, hit like. If you like all our videos, hit subscribe. We've got more videos on the way. You can also follow us on our social pages. And if you want to support the channel further, check out the link in the description to our Patreon account. And you can also chat with us on our Discord server. We'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good one. <laughs> Kermit, Kermit. Hi, I'm Kermit. No, I think I'm losing it. I don't know what this is. I'm gonna stick with it. Oh, sure thing, Troy. Oh, f